Okay, so here we are with the very lightweight and very um, sort of cool looking LG Optimus Black. It's the uh, P970 as it's also known. Uh, we've already shown that it's got Android 2.2.2 built in on the phone itself. If we go back home, I'll show you some of the funky things that are on here. Uh, obviously, we've got this G button, which I showed you on the previous video. Let's just mount my camera a bit better, two seconds. We've got the G button there, so we can press and hold that down. I can move it that way, move it that way. And we can scroll through the screens. Also on the application screen here, I can squeeze the screen like that and we can get the downloads. We can also manage how these things are ordered so we can have the downloads at the top and our applications at the bottom if you want. Change that around like this. So if we go back to our applications I'll show you some of the apps that are available on this device. Got the alarm clock, set an alarm, got an app advisor which is LG that needs a an internet connection obviously you've got the browser which is the usual sort of very cool Android browser got a nice calculator so we can add stuff up and if you notice these buttons on the bottom I just wanted to show you these see these uh, touch sensitive buttons now they're dark by default you can press them and when you actually press them you see how they go blue so you're actually it knows that you've done something with them so they actually show that you press them. It's quite a nice little touch that. Got the FM radio which obviously needs the uh, headphones to connect on. We've got a clock, calendar which will synchronize with Exchange or Google, whatever you fancy. We've got a car home functionality which gives you a nice a big button chunky version of the phone so that you can uh, use it whilst driving even though you shouldn't really but you can actually talk to it and say play music or take a note etc. We've got uh, email, so you can do POP3 email. We've got the good camera on there, 5 megapixel camera on here. Very easy to snap and shoot. The camera photos that I've taken so far are very, very nice. I must say it's um, a camera which works very well. Uh, we've got Facebook for LG. We've got finance application. We've got gallery, which we can obviously see. Uh, I've reset this recently. I don't know whether my previous now. You can see the photos that I've taken in the gallery and of course we can do the tilting thing that will tilt the photos we can slot it round like that we can do the pinch and zoom to zoom in I believe, there we go, like that sorry about this one handed video but this is the uh, fun we have when we get these phones um, these hot new phones for just a short period of time uh, we've got Gmail obviously synchronizes in with everything Google related. We've got LG World, a Google Search, Google Latitude so you can see where you are and where your friends are, Google Maps, Google Market that will take you into the other applications that are available and if this phone focuses I'll show you some other bits and bobs. Come on, there we go. We've got messaging obviously, threaded text messaging, music, we can play some music on here, we've got songs and albums, it's sorted out by artists and you can create playlists on there. And we've got Polaris Office so you can edit documents on the fly when it focuses, sorry about this. Uh, we've got Remote Call, this was uh, something we spotted in the LG Optimus 3D. It will let you place a support call to LG and um, you can get help and they can remotely log into your phone and help out. Uh, there's the phone itself. I've got MySpace. Something called MySpace. I don't know what that is, but uh, apparently it's some sort of social networking site that used to be quite large. News, news and weather, uh, software update function, smart share, because it's got the DLNA functionality, which LG calls smart share, so you can share your media over your Wi-Fi to your connected devices. That's something that your TV might have um, built in. I've got weather, a video player, voice search, Google talk for instant messaging and YouTube. Now most of these I can't actually show you a great deal without a, a network connection but of course you can add these applications to your main screen here, you can move everything around if you want the contacts on there just drag that there. We can add in widgets like press and hold and we can add widgets in here like uh, any of these widgets. And we can also change wallpapers, etc. 
So that's just a tour around the LG Optimus Black from CoolSmartphone.com.